family in the world that loves the Orthodox community more than the Trump family. the job that the whole group has done, and Ralph Meridian, these guys are great friends of mine, and I've known them forever. And so we had to come today, and we had to, I mean, this conference, I have to tell you the first story. I remember the first time, Hershey, you were here, and you had, I don't know, 250, 300 people, and we said, hey, it's a beautiful event. And by the way, the Trump team at Doral, there's no group that they love every year more than this group. I really mean that. from 250 or 300 people, and then it goes to 500, and then it goes to 1,000, and you look at this room tonight, the job that you've done is truly incredible. And, you know, we need a lot more people like that. Does that make sense? Especially in this time. We need more people that believe in capitalism, that believe in America, that believe in... <laughs> that believe in strength, that believe in hard work. Where did that go? Where did that go? And you know what, I see more fight in a group like this, actually at all your conferences, I see more people who are out there doing what Americans do, I think, better than anybody, which is out there networking, hustling, growing great companies, doing great things, and uh, that makes this country really proud. That makes this country really, really proud. Let's go, Brendan. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go, Brendan. <laughs> it's really amazing how that chain took over another chain. I'm not going to say what it is because it'd be really inappropriate, but FJB, baby, FJB. <laughs> and it was not it was not my intent to get political tonight. At the end of the day, I try and do everything I can to stay out of politics at all means possible, but it's not. Uh, but guys, you know, we spend a lot of time fighting in the real estate world, and we do every day. We run great hotels, and we spend a lot of time fighting for this country and what we really believe in. And, you know, when you see the religious component of, you know, tonight, um, you know, it's something that we fought really hard for, you know, across the board, because a lot of that was eroding in kind of society. And it's just, it's great to see a group like this that, again, has so much heart and has so much soul. You are always, always, also welcome at a Trump property, you know that. You will always be a longtime friend, uh, Hershey, and I just, um, I appreciate all you guys, and I just wanted to kick off a great evening. You've got Magic Johnson tonight. What a story he's got. Let's go, Brandon. Let's go, Brandon. <laughs> oh, baby. It's really amazing how that chain took over another chain. I'm not going to say what it is because it'd be really inappropriate, but... FJB, baby, FJB. <laughs> and it was not it was not my intent to get political tonight. At the end of the day, I try and do everything I can to stay. I'm actually a minority in this room. It's really interesting. I, you know, my sister always called me the Shaba Goy, right? Everybody knows this. <laughs> because I'm actually, I'm half Jewish. Yeah, I think everybody knows this, right? Ivanka and Jared are Jewish, and I've done more Sabbath dinners, and I've done more great events, and... You know, occasionally they'll ask me to actually push the button in the elevator to bring them up to the cell. <laughs> uh -oh. I'm outnumbered here tonight. And I have to tell you, there is, I think it might be in this room, right? And, and by the way, Hershey, I'm actually a minority in this room. It's really interesting. I, you know, my sister always called me the Shaba boy, right? Everybody knows this. Because I'm actually... I'm half Jewish. I think everybody knows this, right? Ivanka and Jared are Jewish, and I've done more Sabbath dinners, and I've done more great events, and, you know, occasionally they'll ask me to actually push the button in the elevator to bring them up to the cell. But I'm 